hey everyone welcome to my youtube channel so if you are new to my channel welcome if you've been following me for a while welcome to my channel it has been a long time since i have made a natural hair video but i am back to it i did recently big chop my hair so it's been three months and my hair finally grown back a little bit so today i will be doing another crochet braid but um let me go ahead and take this thing off my hair is still short guys i wanted to do like a uh, box braids but i was like i don't have the energy or the time for it so i went ahead and put my hair in some poof balls so little tiny poof balls as you can see i've been struggling with some breakage right here my hair been thinning out a lot i don't know but I'm going to go ahead and do a protected hairstyling on my hair today. So, um, and it's going to be a crochet braid. So the hair that I decided that I'm going to use, it's by Bobby Boss. And this is a water wave crochet hair. And this is, I guess, the kids version so um this is what it's looking like um this hair is um six inch long and it costs six dollars per pack and i got the color 1b so it's like black it's not jet black but it's um pretty dark um so there's like two times the curl in one pack so it's like they give you they give you like two bundles in one pack and these are tight curls and I really like that about the hair I end up getting five packs of hair I might not even need five packs I'll probably use maybe four packs or three packs I'm not sure but I want my hair pretty full so I'm going to probably end up using all of the hair and if I don't use all of the hair I probably going to take it back to my beauty supply store but this five packs of hair costs $30 and uh, my beauty supply store does like a discount thing where if you go and shop you have a phone number they give you a discount so I got some discounts but this hair costs $30 and I'm going to go ahead and start my hair now because um, I want to hurry up and be done. And also, guys, um, I I got some we uh, some weaving cap for this hairstyle today. I like to use a uh, weaving cap when I do my natural hair because I would rather put all the pressure and tension on the weaving cap than on my natural hair. So that's why. I like to use um, the weaving cap, but you want to get like a if your attempt if your hair is like mine's and you're attempting to do this type of style, you want to get a weaving cap that has like some little holes in it so that when you can be able to do your protective hairstyle. So this weaving cap is pretty snug but i'm going to make it a little bit snugger is that a word i don't know but i'm just going to like you know tie it a little bit not too tight and i'm going to just cut this right here like this part so i end up cutting some of the net off so that way it can be snug on my hair so let me get myself ready for me to do my hair and once i'm ready i'm going to show you guys okay guys so i am going to go ahead and do my hair so i'm going to pull the crochet hook okay so i'm going to put a crochet hook through the rubber band and through the net so like that and I am going to put in the curls. And I'm going to crochet the hair in. 
okay so just like that because this hair is only six inch long i'm only gonna go through the hoop about one time and i'm going to tie the hair okay so i'm just going to do it like that so you want to go through the rubber band and through the net with your crochet hook and um you want to put your hair through the crochet hook close the lash and then um just pull the hair through so just like that and then you want to separate the hair to make like a knot So like that.
you guys so um i am still on the first pack of hair and i still have this much left so um i'm going to go ahead and fast forward this part and finish my hair but um i just wanted to show you guys how i attempt to do this hairstyle but let me go ahead and finish and when I get to the front, I'm going to show you guys how to do the parting part. So it's just stay tuned, guys. Okay, you guys, I am almost done with this hair. So this is what this hair is looking like so far. The hair is pretty full. Um, it's very bouncy, it's soft, and the curls are pretty tight. So I am going to, so I have like four uh, poof balls left because I did put my head in a rubber band and I have four left. So I'm going to attempt to do like a side part right here. But first I'm just going to like focus in the middle of that part. So when you are attempting to do a side part, make sure that um, the amount of, not even a side part, any parts when you're doing this type of hairstyle, make sure that the amount of hair that you are, are using is not too thick okay because we already have the rubber band and the net so we don't want to see the cushion knots on our parts so as you get closer to your part you want to make sure that the hair that you are using for example when you split it you want to make sure that um, the hair is not too thick so that way your part can look a bit nice okay so um that is what I am doing so I'm just doing the same step 
that I did with the rest of my hair. So the parts are looking pretty nice. Okay. So you want to make sure that you're using like little strands of hair when it comes to your parts. And that is what my part is looking like okay okay guys so it is time to cut the net so the hair is pretty full and it's looking really really nice so I'm going to go ahead and cut my net now so I'm just going to pull that and as I cut the net is gonna snap so when it comes to the part you want to look for the net so make sure when you're doing this part you don't cut off your natural hair so I'm just going to just cut you will know when you're cutting the net because the net thing will snap so I'm just going to um, cut and as you cut the net your part should you should be able to see your part a little nicer so this is my part okay so that's what my part is looking like and the rest of the net i'm just going to cut just a little bit okay and with this side i'm just going to cut a little bit you guys so i am done with the hair so this is what the hair is looking like i really 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 like the hair it's really full and it's so bouncy and it's lightweight and it's so soft the hair is so soft so i end up using three packs of hair out of the five packs of hair that i used so once again the hair that i use is by the bobby boss and this is um this is by bobby boss and this is a water wave crochet braid in the color 1b and this hair was about six dollars i got five packs of hair and i only use three packs so literally i have two packs of hair i just know how to make things work <laughs> you can get a full head of head using less hair if that makes sense but um i just wanted to come back on camera so you guys can see the finished look so another options that you guys can do in order to see your part a little nicely so i got some concealer and i'm gonna add a little bit of concealer up on my scalp so you guys can see my part a little better because this hair is kind of covering my part so i'm just going to apply just a tiny bit of concealer so my part can show a little a little nicer i know the concealer is a little bit too light but over time the shade will fade away but look at that now you can see my part but anyways guys this is the end of the video if you like this video thumbs up like comment subscribe um give me some ideas of what type of hairstyle that you guys want to see right now my hair is pretty short so i'm kind of limited um i'm trying to not put too much pressure on my natural hair but um right now this is what the hair is looking like crochet braid for cheap like literally like this hair was so cheap 
but um yeah this is the end of the video and if you guys like this video once again thumbs up like share comment and subscribe and i'll talk to you guys later